I grew up in a family where both of my parents, my grandfather had college educations. So college is something that's just part of my world. But there are many people for whom it's not part of their world. So I use the college as a tool to be able to create programs that break down those walls. My father, because he was a farmer during the Depression, always used whatever he had received in life to try to help those who, like him, came from backgrounds where there weren't opportunity. My mother had always spent a lot of time in arts education and working with young children. When my parents died in 2002, I spent a lot of time thinking about what I could do that would establish a legacy for them in a way that would continue things that had been very important to both of them through their lives. And this is the great thing about art, is you get to express your own ideas and what's important to you. The children who come into the Mumper Stewart Education Center, for some of them it's the first time they have ever been on a college campus. It's the first time they have ever been in an art museum. And now could you all say, Arr. What's a pirate's favorite letter of the alphabet? No, it's the C. With the music outreach program, seeing live musicians is part of their world. The network of initiatives that Dickinson sponsors is amazing. The projects and the programs that students are involved in on the campus, in the community, and all over the globe would totally amaze people who were there when we were. It's our 50th reunion. We were the class that broke the mold in so many ways. I would challenge our class to use their class reunion gifts to explore the opportunities available by giving through Dickinson to create a meaningful impact for those areas that you're interested in. There's a world out there, let's change it. <laughs>